hello and welcome to calf channel today's video is actually gonna be educative exciting and entertaining don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you are new to this channel and also hit the like button and hey keep all comments coming through through the comment section so that we can get very interactive and also without much ado let's jump right into the video Yes, so let's jump right into the video without wasting much time. Let's launch our internet browser and I'm using the Google Chrome in this case. You could use any browser of your choice. And what you're actually going to type in here is UPSA Interpay. All right. You select the first option which says UPSA Interpay. Okay. So once you have that selected, what is required of you now is your index number and your password. Okay, so just enter your index number and your password and hit login. Beautiful. So after hitting the login button, you'll be welcomed with this window. And this is actually your dashboard for your UPSA Interpay. So quickly, we are going to navigate to students, click on the drop down arrow and go to pay mandatory fee okay pay mandatory fee so you realize that the amount you paid at the bank will be deposited here okay so confirm if this is the amount then you move to pay mandatory fee you wait for it to load okay so this is actually the fees for um a continuing student okay this is a continuing student who is trying to get his fees paid all right so i'm going to just walk you through how to quickly do this okay so if you want to pay half of your fees okay this is facility subsidy fee all right for undergraduate right if you want to pay half that is 50 percent of the total amount here which is 4120 it's going to be 2060 okay that's half of this so this is what you're actually going to pay all right so you click select you realize that total amount paid is 2060 all right as i said this is for a continuing student okay so this process is for continuing students it's basically the same thing with first years actually just that you have much more items to pay okay so you just go ahead and select just take note if you are paying half you enter the amount here okay so we are going to proceed to pay our medical levy so we select that too select this select this and select that so then you are going to see the total here and you proceed to go to pay okay so the total we are having here is 2220 proceed to pay do you want to pay selected fees press pay to confirm or cancel to return to previous screen if you are very sure about what you've selected and what you want to pay you just proceed to pay your fees has been successfully paid all right so if you are welcome with this window you should know that you have successfully paid or disbursed your fees so click ok so right now what we are going to do is actually print this particular statement okay we need a proof that we have actually paid our fees from upsa so you go to print statement and then you'll be given these options where it says start date and end date it's actually a statement you are printing so what start date do you want the statement to cover okay so let's say um let's hit let's say july 31st and then the ending could be 7th just know that we are we are actually giving the system a range for it to print our statement okay you can actually do it from july or from january or anything you are giving them a range to print the statement so click on print statement and this will download your statement right here for you so click on start download and have it opened
so as you can see here this is what we just dispensed okay so this is what you're actually going to print and take to the school for verification i mean to prove that you have paid your fees so for the first years this is basically the same procedure as i said earlier you are going to have much more um, items to pay and that is just it okay so if you did enjoy today's video don't forget to give it a like and also hit the subscribe button if you are new to this channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button now so that you can get updated on every video we post okay so stay safe and have a wonderful evening